In a surprising discovery, astronomers have observed a young planet evaporating its layers as it orbits a red dwarf star, exhibiting unpredictable changes in its atmosphere. The planet, known as AU Mike B, is located in one of the youngest planetary systems ever observed, hosted by the star AU Microscopii, which is less than 100 million years old and situated 32 light years from Earth. AU Mike B, discovered in 2020 by NASA's Spitzer and TESS Space Telescopes, orbits its parent star every 8.46 days at a distance of just 6 million miles, roughly a tenth of the distance between Mercury and our Sun. Despite its close proximity to its star, the planet's atmospheric loss varies dramatically from orbit to orbit as confirmed by observations done through the Hubble telescope. The planet's atmosphere was observed puffing out in front of the planet during one orbit, a phenomenon that puzzled scientists. This observation challenges existing models of planetary evolution, and raises questions about the potential habitability of planets orbiting red dwarf stars like AU Mike. Red dwarfs are the most abundant stars in our Milky Way galaxy. They are known for their ferocious stellar flares and intense magnetic fields, which can unleash energy up to 1,000 times more powerful than our Sun's outbursts. These conditions could potentially strip a planet of its atmosphere within the first 100 million years of the star's birth. The variability in AU Mike B's atmospheric outflow may be due to the host red dwarf's extreme outbursts. One theory suggests that a powerful stellar flare could have photoionized the escaping hydrogen, to the point where it became transparent to light, making it undetectable. Another possibility is that the stellar wind is shaping the planetary outflow, causing it to be observable at some times and not at others. Further observations of AU Mike B with the Hubble Space Telescope should provide additional insights into this unusual star-planet interaction, testing scientific models of exoplanetary atmospheric escape and evolution.